Hey, what's up, everybody? This is Louis B. Broadcasting live from Crotch Shot Studios. Somebody probably wondering what's up with that. Um, since I work nights, um, you know, I, uh, you know, I, I like to keep the sun out, so I just put up poster board instead because they block out the sun better than actual curtains. So that way I could st- sleep well without the sun bothering me. Um, and actually, I just wanted... To, that's what I wanted to talk about. Um, I This is going out to the skaters. Shred well, my people. Shred well. Um, as a security guard, I, I've been seeing a lot of these videos where security guards are taking skaters' um, boards... Uh, fighting them, like putting their, getting violent with them, and uh, just just being fucking jackbooted thugs. First of all, um, I, I'm not gonna get into the whole police thing. I'm just gonna focus solely on security guards. Security guards are not allowed to do that shit. They are not cops. They do not have special powers of arrest more than any normal citizen. Uh, the only time we can arrest somebody is placing them under citizen's arrest. And then you have to immediately call the police. And you know what? A lot of times... Um, so, uh, you know, you don't have to stop when a, when a security guard says stop unless... Unless... You're trespassing. If you're not allowed to be in a building, we could tell you leave. That's it. But if you don't leave, it still does not give us the permission to put our hands on you. Take your shit. It doesn't. It doesn't. The most we could do is say, hey, get the fuck out of here. And even that might be too much. Because you could uh, you could actually call their company and be like, he said fuck, and get that guy fired. It's so easy to get a security guard fired, to the point where most of us don't even want to deal with it. Like, we say, hey guys, like, 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 we don't, we don't want, like, to deal with the bullshit. It could mean, like, extra paperwork, um, risk losing our jobs or getting arrested, Um, so, look, guys, skaters, if it's not a skate park, if it's not in the street, I mean, I know some of these places have, like, fun shit to hop on and off, you know, the people that we work for are pricks, (laughs) and, uh, they don't want, you know, they, they don't want to risk their shit getting damaged, like stairs getting chipped, because that could mean, be dangerous for regular people who are using those stairs for what they were intended to, to climb up and down. And if they're chipped, they could trip, and boom, lawsuit. And plus, it's kind of a dickish thing to ruin somebody else's fucking property, you know, and having to fucking fix that shit. So, I mean, I'm just coming, like, guys, don't be dicks. Like, because at the, like, it, like the umpteen time, we're like, oh, come on. Because it means fucking extra work for basically that they don't pay us for. We don't get paid enough. And, you know, and let me, I mean, I'm not, I'm, I'm, I'm not trying to, like, make you guys feel sorry for security guards, but. Look, a lot the the um the job industry is shit. And basically the only jobs available are these low wage fucked up fucking security guard jobs. Um trust me, I I have a blog fucking talking shit about the security guard industrial complex. It, it is it is bullshit. It is a bullshit, uh, you know, but that's the only jobs that are pretty much out there that, you know, you could go in with a absolutely zero fucking experience and fucking get a job. 
unfortunately. And some people are stuck doing security because, hey, I'm trying to get out of security myself. And, oh, you have no experience. Why don't you go, you have all your experience doing security. Why don't you go look for a job in that? Because I don't want to do fucking security. You think, you think normal people, normal people who do security want to fuck with skaters? All we really want to do is do whatever we, the, our original job we have to do. Take our break, study whatever we gotta study, or just fucking sit on our asses and relax while collecting a fucking paycheck. You think we wanna go out and fuck with some little white kids or black kids, fucking with dreads or whatnot, fucking having to deal with probably with Mike Vallely trying to kick our ass because we're telling him to get off because he, he, you know, you wanna stomp on some shit because you think that shit is funny? Nah. We don't want to deal with the fucking paperwork. We don't want to have to deal with the risk of getting arrested or getting jumped. Like, again, we don't get paid enough to deal with bullshit. We're not cops. We don't we don't carry guns. We don't carry pepper spray. A lot of times we're not even allowed to fucking, you know, if we get punched in the face, we can't even defend ourselves. If we block, like in theory, if we block... And you get hurt because we blocked. Oh shit, we're getting fired and you have a lawsuit. So, I mean, this is some advice from our skaters. I know six minutes in. Again, shred well, my people. Shred well. Um, in fact, I mean, side note. I ride a, I ride a trike. There it is. I get more respect from the cycl uh, from not from uh, the skaters than the fucking cyclists. Cyclists are fucking queers. Um, if you ride a bicycle, you know, go fuck yourself. I hope you lose another testicle like fucking Lance Armstrong, you shit dicks. Um, <laughs> no place I'd rather be. No, 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 no place I'd rather be. Okay, I'm sorry. <laughs> okay, you don't have to stop. You don't have to stop if a security guard tells you to stop. Just get the fuck out of the building as quickly as possible. If he starts following you and, and outside of his building, film that shit and contact his and contact his fucking uh, his company. Show him the video. Get his ass fired. Cause as soon as that, as soon as he leaves the building, he has no fucking authority. No, no fucking authority whatsoever. In fact, basically, he has no authority in the building. The only thing, basic, basically, what he's doing is babysitting a fucking building. And you know, you, he can't, he, he he can't hit you, he can't grab you, he can't forcibly remove you. He, what he could do? Look what you're doing. Look where you're going. Get your, get your uh, description. Call the cops. Let the cops fucking get hurt uh, trying to remove your asses out. That's it. That's what they're there for. That's what our fucking tax dollars are there for. In fact, the cops' job is to protect the business. That is their job, is protecting business. Not protecting human life. Fuck that. It's all about, it's all about protecting businesses. So they have to, they'll, they'll, they'll have to remove you. But if you're not there for the cops to show up, who are they going to arrest? I'm just, it really fucking irks me when you see all these fucking, uh, these wannabe fucking cops, you know, these security guys that wanna be fucking cops, fucking putting their hands on people. Like, and, the, and, again, I'm a security guard myself, and I'm happy when one of these skaters punches a motherfucker in the face. Oh, don't be grabbing me. Bam! You're going way too far. You're taking your job way too fucking seriously over some bullshit. And again, you know, you know, again, skaters, guys, you know, you know, just stay the fuck out of private property. I know, I know it seems cool and shit, but, you know, you avoid problems. Unless, unless you like getting these videos of fucking with security guards and pissing them off and, and, and putting them in a situation where they, you know, you could fuck them up. I, I guess, I don't know, I, I probably, I could, I guess I could see the, the fun in that shit, but, um, 
I dive into frozen ways where the past comes back to life. So, um, yeah, so I'm just, so, yeah. So keep that in mind, and, yeah, again, be safe out there, you know, stop fucking with people. Security guards, stop acting like you're fucking cops. We don't get paid enough to, to put up with their, with the bullshit cops have to put up with. We don't get paid enough to have to do extra fucking paperwork. Because a lot of times, we gotta stay, after our shift, fucking rewriting, rewriting, rewriting fucking reports. Like, for what? For what? It's not like these little kids are gonna go to jail. They just get a warning, hey, don't come back there. That's it. Why the, you know... Just take a picture of them, you know, and, and make her, you know, and do like, like, hey, I saw these kids here, I give it to the cops. Let the fucking cops handle it if it's that much of a trouble. But grabbing their boards, freaking trying to restrain them and, and detain them, you're breaking the law. <laughs> you're the criminal then, and they would have every right to fucking knee you in the face to get you off their boy or girl and shit. So, anyway, that's my two cents. Again, my skaters shred well. My friends shred well.